So let's go for this pipe and figure out what's gonna happen now. Come on, Jacob. Oh, what the? How many of them they're gonna be? Yo, step on it. No, no, no. There's so many of them. But hey, on the bright side... Oh, you can kill them all with just one stomp. That's cool. I was not expecting that jump scare right off the bat. Ah, a little bit of Callisto coins. We'll take those. Unfortunately, not many healing items. So now that we're maxed out in health... Uh, wait, did we come that way? Yeah, that's the way that we came from. Okay, can we try to do this again? Okay, you opened that already. So what did we achieve by doing that? We can go back through the door, that's for sure. Wait, what? Okay, we gotta look for that red pipe once again. But what did you deactivate? Oh, the creature in the water. To be fair, our weapon is stronger than ever. So I don't think that we should be afraid of that creature. I think that's the way that we gotta go. Just keep oh, that's a red pipe. You see it? Nice. Go for it, Jacob. You know the rule, Jacob. Keep following that red pipe. And now, we not only are in the water, but we're also in a tight space. And we have a health kit right there. Oh, you guys know what's gonna happen, right? They're gonna bring me a fight. They have to do it. Do you guys hear it? You guys know what's gonna happen next. <laughs> oh, there's a ladder. Okay, I mean, I'll take ladders. Ladders are cool. It takes me out of the water. The level of detail in this game, I gotta... I, I, I'll, I'll keep saying this over and over again, but the level of detail in this game is absolutely fantastic. Everything looks beautiful. Oh! No, no! Dodge! The power, the power that you gain once you start using the combos in this game is crazy. So it makes me believe that this game goes from like being a, a survival horror to a fighting game. Oh wait, what? Dodge once, twice. Now let's go for you. So for some reason, sometimes whenever you're actually trying to do the quick shoot at the enemies, it's, it doesn't work as well as you would anticipate, like, it's not such a good instant aim, which makes you waste bullets. But, I mean, I'm not gonna complain about it, because the game is, like, kind of, like, not making it, like, vanilla for you. But I gotta say that if you're giving me the option to, like, do that quickly, I believe that the, the, the assist aim on that, on that specific case should be a little bit better. The main reason why I'm saying that is because... Well, oh, that's a red pipe. So if we follow the red pipe, we got to go that way. Okay. The main reason why I'm saying that is because... Did we come this way? No. Getting there. The main reason why I'm saying that is because you, mi you waste bullets whenever you miss a shot, right? But then you're using the auto, and if you miss the auto, then, then the enemies hit you. So I think there is a balance right there. Get off me, please! Now we have to heal. We have to waste our precious healing items. I think this is the last one that we have. So I think after this one, we are in a lot of danger. I don't think we have any other way to heal. Let's check it out. Yeah, we're, we're pretty messed up in healing. We should have killed these enemies before healing, though, because sometimes they have healing items. In this case, they do not. We need. I, I get the feeling that now that our handgun is maxed out, we should be uh, using the, the handgun a little bit more. Seems like that's the correct way to go. Oh, hello there. You want some? 
Come on. Yep, it's shit. Who else wants some? There's another one. Oh, you. It's you. Hi. Goodbye. Give me that healing item. See, that's exactly what I mean. It's like sometimes, sometimes killing these guys is pretty easy. Sometimes killing them not that easy. But once you get the hang of it, it feels good. And every single big boy gives you a lot of Callisto credits. Like, that's fantastic. So now we can start improving our, our baton, I guess. That's my guess. I'm guessing that improving the baton is going to be like the meta. Just making sure that you are as strong as you can possibly get with the melee damage. Because it seems like every single thing that you do in this game leads to melee damage. Something came behind me. Oh, come on. Touch that and let's go for the hit. Oh, is he dead? Yes. How many bullets do we have? Okay, we're, we're capped out in bullets. That's good. You gotta love it when the game, like, you open up a chest and it gives you a bunch of items, and between those items, you get bullets. And then among those bullets, it is like, oh, yeah. Um, just a reminder you're gonna use all the bullets that I just give you. That's still pretty good. Got grabbing some Callisto coins in exchange, I'll take that. I cannot wait to find my next place to upgrade weapons because I think I have enough for some upgrades. And that's gonna feel good. That's gonna feel really good. What is this place? And why is it so bright? What do they what do these guys used to do in here? This door, it seems like it's a pretty big door. It seems like that's a way to go. So let's let's check the surroundings for a second. Hmm. We can break this. Maybe some sort of shortcut. Um, yeah. It, it's always confusing which is the correct way. Because I get the feeling that... Oh my god. Okay, let's go this way. You never know. We can, call, we can always come back. Whatever creature is in here, we'll kill it. There's nothing. What was with that sound? This is too bright for me. Something is gonna grab me from behind, huh? Or not? You know... You guys might think otherwise, but I feel like one of the most horrifying things in video games... Is... Oh, okay. One of the most horrifying things in video games is when games don't actually give you enemies to kill. Because I feel like when they don't give you enemies to kill, that's when you actually... That's when things become spooky. Because you don't actually know what to do with, with the items. What is that? Am I going to get some new weapons from this? Unlocked? What? How am I even going to know where to come back from? Some small creatures over here. That's okay. Okay, we, we don't have any... Okay, we do have a couple of web, a, a couple of bullets that we can reload. And this, is, this all seems like secondary stuff that we can grab. But I swear, if the game gives me like a better... Uh, can I break this? You cannot. If the game gives me like a better armor or something out of this, I'm gonna be so happy. Uh, yeah, we just got some extra items. What about you give me something a little bit better? Game, please. Oh, we're still getting a lot of Callisto coins, and that's pretty neat. Oh, that, that thing is damaged. Nothing that you can do. What is this place? Is this supposed to be like some sort of like medical ward or something? Or medical side of things? Nice. So you got a condenser, and then you have a healing item. What do I have in abundance? Uh, we can get rid of this. Honestly speaking, I feel like the healing items are worth more. Especially because I don't use my pool too much.
The reason why I don't pull that much is because I don't actually like how the pulling system works on controller. I feel like it doesn't feel natural because... Wait, this is locked. Okay. Oh, okay, you have to disinfect before going in. Got it. And the main reason why it doesn't feel natural... Is there something here? No? Okay, time to go back. Is because you have to use the... You use X, which is at the bottom, to be able to, like, pull enemies in. So if you're gonna be, like, more... If you're gonna have... Hello! You're gonna come here? Can I break your legs? I guess he said you cannot, but that's fine. Come here. <laughs> Are you still stumbling ac across your ally? That's fine. So, of course, if the game doesn't get you on the way in, the game will get you on the way out. That's how it works in these games. So, it's fine. Oh, it's a healing place. I cannot open it, though. Because I'm max health, and that's perfectly fine. This is a battery pack. And where's the other enemy? We killed two guys, right? No? Are you telling me that one of the guys just disappeared just like that? Oh, he's here. How did you end up in here, my friend? A good thing that I checked for you, because those Callisto coins, those will come in handy. Now it's time to go back. We didn't actually find anything too impressive. I was actually looking forward to something cooler. What do you mean by number six? E three twenty one E. I think I found a way to reach the dawn. Just gotta train in the tank. Uh, yeah. Then then up the ladder to the access hatch. Yes, yeah, sir. Ju just wrapping up. What? First, I need the console card. Get the gold from the guard. Okay. So it seems like. Yeah, we will look for him. It seems like Elijah was up to something. He really wanted to escape this place. So I'm guessing that everything that he was trying to do was to escape, escape this area. And it's pretty neat that they're showing you everything that he was doing because it kind of like builds up to exactly what he's saying that he's doing for us. Like he hired, uh, he, he looked for me because I can fly a ship. And then he looked for the hacker because, well, she can mess up with the system. So that, that all connects and that kind of makes sense. What happens if I go this way? Oh, this doesn't take me back. So where do you take me? Sorry. I didn't mean to step on you. I actually did, but doesn't matter. So you have a lot of things in here, but nothing to grab. And we have a converter, but we don't have a weapon system that we can sell. So that's unfortunate. I really need more space. And this is our way back. Beautiful. So there's only one door that we can actually access. Kinda need to see that there's nothing in there for us to, that, that's gonna try to kill us. Instead, we can just... You can hear them. Oh, this is the weapon upgrade place. Fantastic. So we're max health. That's good. We're max health again. That's fine. Alright. Let me grab some of the Callisto coins and... I am going to be doing some weapon upgrades right now. I'll show you guys in a second because I'm going to be moving around and selling some stuff. And we're done improving our weapon. You guys can see that the electricity now is uh, yellow. So there is an option that actually allows you to improve the damage of your weapon. Now let's keep going. What is that? Is that a robot? Or is that just a cage? What a person. Oh, wait, webs? Ugly son of a bitch. Um, I'm sorry for what I'm about to do, but... Nope, I guess you cannot. I thought you were gonna be able to, like, break in for some... Shoot the tentacles. Oh, no. 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 No, no. What the? Hello? Okay, that... I don't like this! Come on again. I think you're dead, friend. 
Oh my god, shoot the exposed tentacles to quickly kill enemies. Stomp down the enemies to prevent them from mutating further. Oh baby, mutated enemies are... Oh, they, they, they're creepy. I gotta give them credit for that. They are creepy. Now, this guy knew what he was asking you. Shoot the tentacles. He wrote that down before dying? Oh, come on, Jacob. You gotta take it easy. This is a little bit too brutal for these guys. Poor man. Oh. Oh, new permissions? Oh, that's a security card. Okay, got it. Well, getting that security card was actually quicker than I anticipated. Can we go back the same way that we came in? We can probably, but... If the game is giving me a way forward, then why would I say no? Uh, are you kidding me? Every single time. If you get... If you heal yourself, you will get healing items. It works all the time. Um, what is over there? There's an unlocked door in there. Oh, we went all the way around. Gotcha. So now, since we went all the way around, we can go this area and we can actually just get the healing item. We used one. Let's grab one. Wait. Oh, we don't need that. Not yet. Time to write down the code. Are we going to actually figure out what Elias was trying to do? Enemies are gonna... Hello? Nice. Let's say that those enemies are a little bit creepier than anticipated. Once they start growing their tentacles, they become terrifying. They have so much health, it is unbelievable. That guard was just sitting there, putting the code. He was trying to give his own access code. What are we gonna gain from this? You guys think we're cleaning all the poop of this place? Is that what's going on? Purge cycle in progress. What the f <laughs> oh shit. What is that? What is that? Oh, we missed. Listen, I, I want to fight you, but you have to come my way, please. Where are you going? Come here! Okay, I think he's dead. I think we got it. I think our excess in weapon, in bullet damage did it. Oh no, there's another one. Oh, where, where are you coming from? Oh no! Get off me! No, no! Don't get close! There's another one, right? I saw it. It is invisible. Oh, there it is. I hit it, right? Oh, he went up. Oh no, he's invisible right there. He's coming my way. Did we kill it? How many more do we have to deal with? Give me the ammo, please. I think this is it, right? Yeah, it's almost over. It's over. Ooh, that was a little bit too intense for my heart. I wasn't expecting invisible enemies to, to come this way. And what is that? Some items? Maybe more bullets? We didn't kill anything in there. Okay. I'll take the bullets. They're nice. Ah, we were able to finish the cycling in section number six and killing all of those things. Those things are really ugly. Everything in this game really does remind me of all the creatures that we dealt with in Scorn. 
But a little bit creepier because these creatures, they, they, they want to kill you. And they are not afraid to go your way and like stomp over you. So, yeah. Now, something that I would like to know from this episode from you guys is what is your favorite horror game of all times? Please do let me know in the comment section down below. Personally speaking, for me, favorite horror game. Oh, shit. Uh, come on. That was scary. Personally speaking, for me, favorite horror game has to be Resident Evil 1, the one in the mansion. That one did get me when I was younger. It got me big time. I don't know, there was something about that game that for some reason didn't let me sleep at night. I couldn't even play it. Yeah, what do you think, Jacob? You literally, you literally, literally went in a place full of shit. So what were you expecting for? What do you think? You were gonna smell like flowers or roses? I sure hope you didn't expect that, because if you did, you're a little bit too stupid. Alright, let's keep going. These creatures are really after our bot. Everything wants to kill you. You don't have a choice, man. Yeah, this is something that is a, a, a classic of every single survivor horror game. Everything is against you. Even the humans. Oh no. Oh, we're gonna die. Come on, Jacob. Come on, be careful. We're actually moving our character right now. Don't hit any walls. Don't hit any walls. Oh boy. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, no, no. Oh, oh no. Oh. Ah, that was painful. You're not gonna be able to sleep after that. Probably two or three bones got broken. Is that a. Oh, is that gonna follow me? Oh, that was nice. Through the middle. Oh no 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 no! Ooh! Ah! Ooh! I'm so nervous there now, guys. We cannot die. We shouldn't die right now. Come on, Jacob. Keep moving. Stay to the left. To the right now. It's too dark for me to see. I think we did it, guys. Is that a creature? Oh. Is this their nest? Get off me, get off me! Kill it, kill it! Oh, what an ugly creature. Oh, Jacob, you are the man. Grab it, grab it, yes! me my man Jacob is a big big champ this guy is not afraid of anything he's worse than a cat he's got so many lives this guy's insane and look at his strength if I had to do something like this I would be dead in an instant Did you just speed at teeth? This fucking place. That makes us too. Alright. Alright. Without a paddle. <laughs> That's a really nice uh, achievement that you get for surviving that section. Are you gonna give me any healing items? Cause we, we sure took some damage in there. Just a little bit, but we still took damage. Uh, energy converter, that sounds good. Uh, are we gonna... No, we gotta go to the water if we're gonna check it out. I think that's a healing item. 
Let's grab that. Yeah. Any weapon improvements? Uh, something to improve my weapons right now? Uh, unlock gate. That's good to see. But now that we went through the sewage system, where do you guys think this game is going to take me? I am not sure. Who knows? 